I say Simon Says, and then I say put your hand on your nose, you're going to do this. The first thing we're going to do is play a name game. So I'm going to pass this around, and the teachers are going to give us an example, and we're going to say our names and one thing that we like to do. So I'm going to start. My name is Zoe, and I like to read. Hi, guys. My name is Azzy, and I like to sing. <laughs> um, my name is Jerry, and I like to play soccer. My name is Cece, and I love to play basketball. My name is Albert, and I like to play video games. My name is Gerald, and I like to run. My name is Dasha, and I like to learn about the ocean. My name is Gabriel, I like to play soccer. <laughs> my name is Gloria, and I like to do art. My name is Marina, and I like to play school. Hi guys, how are you guys doing today? Good. Okay. Um, well, we're going to be talking about our campus and your campus that you have. So campus is where your school is at. So this is our school. So pretend, say you're Superman, you're flying over your school. So this is, these are your classes, and this is where you guys play. Okay, and this is our school that we go that we go to now, and you're gonna move to next year. So this is a big lawn, and this is where you can go and you can play, and you can run around and have fun with your friends. And then we have a space right here which has a garden in the middle. So we should design innovation academy meets. Um, do you guys know what architecture meets? Yes. 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 Designing a built a thing. So, our definition is the art or practice of designing and constructing buildings. And we'll be right actually what architecture you guys would like on your campus. Architecture is creating your own kind of building. So, imagine building something like your own house or your own little tree house. What architecture would you guys like on your new campus? Let's, let's make a list together. Can I have some pants? You? Monkey bars. Okay, monkey bars are fun. Um, um, swings. Swings. Yeah, really good. Good idea. Slides. Yeah. Anybody else have ideas? Blocks. Blocks. What is that? I like to build. Oh, blocks. Blocks. Oh, blocks. Okay. Um, corner. Blocks. Three. Um, I want to build a racetrack. A racetrack. Yeah. I'd like to build ropes. Ropes? Ropes, and ladders. Okay. ropes and ladders, okay. A maze. Ooh, guys, these are really good ideas. We'll think about these, okay? We're going to be talking to you guys about money. <laughs> Who over here likes money? <laughs> um, okay, so the meaning of fundraiser is when you raise money for a project. So what we're going to be doing is a cornhole fundraiser, and it's when we are going to sell cornhole boards to raise money. We will use the money earned from the fundraiser to fund the second exhibition project. Exhibition is what we work on all year, and at the end of the year, we show everything that we made. Mm -hmm. Exhibition is where we show your hard work. Mm -hmm. Exhibition? Is when we is where we show what we have been doing in class. Exhibition is showing what we learned by the past years. Mm -hmm. Okay, so our first semester exhibition project, we're building a cornhole board to raise money for a fundraiser. And for our second exhibition project, we're going to build architecture on your campus for next year. Hi guys. 
Um, I'm Asi, as you guys know. Um, today I'm just going to show you guys how to play the game Cornhole. So, who in here likes to play games? Okay, everybody, right? Okay. Someone wants to play the game? Okay. My favorite game is tennis. Alright, cool. Mm -hmm. My game is football. Okay. Okay. So cornhole is this like really fun and simple game that like everyone can enjoy. Um, how to like their points is like there's this little hole. So you toss. Here, can I have the? Okay, I'm gonna show you guys how to toss it. Can you do? Can you oh. be my yeah. <laughs> partner? Sorry. All right. So this is how you toss it into the hole. And if you get it into the hole, you get three points. And if you get it on the board itself, you get one point. If you don't get it on the board, then there's no points. But it's still fun. And so whoever has, you just add up your points, and whoever has the most points just like has the most points, and that's cool. And so here's a short video on how to play point hole. This is how you play point hole. pretend you have a bag, all right? So you want to kind of step forward and pretend like you're tossing a bag underneath something. So can we all do that? Okay, ready? Awesome. Okay, that's exactly how you do it. Okay. Hello, guys. Um, I'm Jerry. Okay. Um, the points. Okay. If you land the little, like, the, the bag on, on the board, like, she's, uh, like as he said, it's, you get one point. If you make it in the hole, then it's three points. And then there's two teams. I'm guessing there's two teams. Yeah. Okay. And in the end of the game, uh, you count up like your colors points. So like right right now like red and blue are tied. You know, three three. Okay. But um, in the end, you count up all your points, and whoever has the most points, like yes. No. No. <laughs> Whoa, you guys are really good.
Oh, that's just architecture. <laughs> oh, Shelly's a turtle. They have a a um. What kind of turtle is it? A tortoise. A tortoise. Cool. Um, a chicken coop for our chickens. Good idea. That's architecture. It should be in the shade. <laughs> oh, so we could maybe build something for shade. Yes, shade. Um, shade. Seesaw. Oh, it's like going to seesaw. We'll take three more. A ball pit. Badminton court. Badminton. Badminton. Okay, so we created a video to demonstrate how to play the cornhole board game. This is the other person. Okay, let's start. 
you're going to try to toss the bean bag into the hole. If it doesn't make it on the board, it's no point. If it makes it on the board, it's one point. If it makes it in the hole, it's three. because I got two on the board, which is two points, and Kayla got none on the board. She has zero. <laughs> so in that game, Morgan won because she got one on the board, and that was one point. <laughs> We just showed you the basics on how to throw the bag into the hole. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye. <laughs> Go watch that. Just sum up the video. <laughs> track points is that e there's two teams and there's red and blue and each beanbag is different colors so there'll be blue beanbags and then there'll be red beanbags so and um, the way you track points is when it lands on the board it's one point but if you sink it if you throw it into the hole you get three points so yeah cool. as you can see Let's practice tracking the points together, right? How many points is that, guys? One. You guys ask them. Four. 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 Five. Okay, how many does the red team have? One. One. Uh -huh. <laughs> what? Oh, what is the ma what's the math equation to figure out this? Three plus, Three plus one, one and zero. one plus zero. Yeah. So you would subtract the two numbers to get your score for that round. Okay. So you start with the highest score and then you subtract the lowest score. What was the equation? Four minus one equals three. Four minus one equals three. Now we get to play outside. Yeah. So who's winning right now, guys? This time I will go. Lucas, how many points do you have? I have seven. So who's winning right now? Uh, By how many points? I got nine. Two points. points, good job. But still, I'm the victor and I'm very proud of I say that. you play again. <laughs> okay. Lucas, I think you can do it. Yes, I know what I'm doing. Yeah. Uh, like, I went over it. Okay.